As part of effort to maximize the benefits of the Waste to Wealth Initiative, the Lagos State's government is set to create a sustainable environment through investment and ensure that the state remains innovative. Addressing State House correspondent at Alausa Ikeja to announce this year's Lagos Circular Academy Hotspot 2023, the Permanent Secretary, Office of Environmental Services, Dr. Omobolaji Gaji, said the two-day event theme towards a circular and resourceful economy, the future of Lagos, will emphasize the need to turn waste to wealth so as to create economic value for the state. To demonstrate government commitment, the Technical Working Group on Circular Lagos was constituted with the objective of driving the framework and a roadmap for the transition. With all these activities and interactions, the Lagos Circular Economy Hotspot avails us the opportunity to highlight how, uh, how Lagos State is transitioning towards the circular economy and how our uh, businesses and citizens are co-creating innovations. This initiative will allow us to deepen the conversation as we build on our climate adaptation policies our 30-year Lagos development plan, and the role of each and every stakeholder in building a sustainable society. Gaji Father said the Circular Academy Hotspot was an initiative of uh, the Kingdom of Netherlands, which serves as a platform to foster co-creation and highlight cities and society's transmission towards circular economy. Participants at the briefing expressed satisfaction with the support from the federal government over the initiative. The hotspot and it is called, if you remember what the hotspot is, is a divergence of weight, meaning that it starts from something and it's spreading out for all of us to see. And I'm also glad we have some of our SMEs who are doing things. It's not an opportunity for us to showcase those people who have identified one problem or the other and have also started to create solutions. We also say we can support ourselves, we can also patronize them, but we can also see what can be done towards a greater neighborhood that is safe, that is sustainable, resourceful, and circular. And it is just the beginning of that conversation that we all will be part of to create that society. One person can find, one family can find, one thing can find to ensure that our resources are efficiently utilized. What spot is a movement? It's for one to discuss niche subject matter within that nation. Um, we thought that they talked about education, secular curriculum. We talked about how we reduce books. And also, Mrs. Francisco also talked about the textile industry. Um, Cutting and fiber industries have been discussing the Dutch countries. They want to look at how security in textile industry. So, the hotspot is one where we come in there and we being specific subjects or areas where I look at civil economy and low value chain of that system or that development. It's about Nigeria. So, we want to do something that, so that every other person can follow up on, because most of the time when we do things in Lagos, people coming from other states don't know about it. And when they get into Lagos, they continue in their old ways. And that's why we have, we, we be doing back and forth, back and forth on some of these issues. And when you, when you punish such people, what you get is that you are, um, you are cheating them because they are poor. No, no, that's not the issue. Mr. Governor is not about that. Mr. Governor is about um, safety of citizens, uh, making sure that we reduce our waste, we reduce uh, what we do, and we can create economic value around what we do, so that there will not be waste. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.